Hello everybody, we're here in Fort Mel at a place called Bossy Bula's, which is an awesome chicken restaurant. These chicken restaurants are popping up everywhere. We've tried many of them. Never met one I haven't liked yet, and I really have high hopes for this place. By the way, it's ready for fall season, man. Here is my Nightmare Before Christmas hat. I'm wearing a Fright Fest Six Flags t-shirt. We are in the spirit, but here it is, Bossy Beulahs. And look at how cool this place looks, man. It's got like a kind of a retro feel to it. I love this. This is so awesome. And it's got a really nice patio under here, under this awning. I mean, look at this, dude. What more could you want? This is the south on a bun. Huh. All right, dude. But here it is, dude. And here's Bossy Beulahs, man. Check it out. Oh, look, they have a little bar in here. So we draft beer, little t-shirts and stuff. Oh, nice. Hey! <laughs> it's so cool. And let's take a look at the menu up here. Here's the menu. Alright. And just check this out, man. Wow. They have catering too. Here's a look at the catering menu. That's pretty freaking cool. Anyways, we got the che I got the cheesy butte. Ginger got the regular butte. Who's Aunt Butte? That's Aunt Butte. Making the best chicken in Iredell County, born in 1906. Uh, if you want to read that, feel free to pause, but I'm not going to sit here and stare at it. But yeah, there's Aunt Butte and Uncle Gilbert. Alright, so here we go. Here is the uh, total today. And that's for everything here, so. Here, look at that. What'd you get, Stella? Um, a burger. A burger? No, a uh, chicken sandwich. Chicken sandwich. All right. Here's my chicken sandwich. I got an unsweet tea, because I'm weird like that. I'm from the South, and I drink unsweet tea. And here it is, the Cheesy Butte. Take a look at that. It's a nice, compact, tightly fitted bun look at this fries. with this big hunk of chicken in the middle and the cheese just perfectly melted to it, man. Just look at that. Oh, oh man. man. Look at this bun. This bun looks amazing. Mm -hmm. I know. Mm -hmm. There we go. Look at all those pickles. Oh my goodness. Damn, dude, that looks so good. And here are the fries. Oh my god, this all looks amazing. I'm so excited. We're gonna try the bossy sauce on a french fry. Mm. Oh, and what kind of cookie is this? Uh, cocaine cookie, it said. Cocaine? Cocaine. 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 I don't know what a okay. cocaine cookie is. I think it's some sort of, like, I don't know, the, the bun is also a cocaine bun. Oh, so. interesting. So I'm gonna doctor up this sandwich here, dude. Oh my god, this looks so good. I just tried some of that hot sauce. It's delicious. It stings a bit, but it's so good. But now we're gonna try this. Check it out, dude. I added some of the bossy sauce to it. We're gonna go in right now. Okay, now I actually dipped it in the bossy sauce. Juicy chicken. Very flavorful. This is it tastes very fresh. This is so good. I don't even know where to begin. Like that chicken is so juicy, so crispy on the outside. But so juicy, it's just like you just cut through it, your teeth cut through it like butter. And the 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 bun tastes like one of the yeast rolls from like yeah. Quincy's, you know? It's so good. It has a nice yeasty, like a Quincy's yeast roll. But you put the honey butter on. It's amazing. Um, I loved every bite of that. The fries remind me of Five Guys fries, but better. Um, and that, the uh, bossy sauce is just out of this world. I knew that if I come to a place like this, you gotta try the sauce. This is like, 
a, a true southern food place. When they say the South on a bun, they're not kidding. It's it, south it in is. Your mouth. Yeah. <laughs> you ever get some South in your mouth? Anyway, um, now we're gonna try this cookie here. Mmm, my God. Okay, so. When I showed you the cookie earlier, you probably noticed these little white specks on there. You can see it right there. That is salt. And it tastes so good. It's sweet and salty at the same time. And it just bangs and explodes with the perfect combination. This is absolutely delicious, man. And it's so soft, so yummy. Wow. I'm blown away by this place. If you sprinkle when you tinkle, be a sweetie and wipe the CD. From Ant Butte. So, in other words, if you piss in the toilet and you piss all over the seat, don't be a fucking pig and leave it for the next person to sit down so they get your piss all over the bottom of their ass. That's fucked up. Don't be a disgusting son of a bitch. So, yeah, Bossy Beulah's rules. It's awesome. You have to check them out. It's here in Pineville, right across. No, no, no. Fort Mill. I'm sorry. It's here in Fort Mill, right across from the park, whatever the name of this park Walter is. Walter Alicia. Walter something. Alicia. It's right across from the Walter Alicia Park here in Fort Mill, South Carolina. Truly exceptional place for chicken, and their sandwiches are great. The place looks awesome. Um, and like I said, man, if you come here, don't be a fucking disgusting son of a bitch. Don't be a fucking pig and piss all over the toilet seat and not wipe it up. If you do, I'm going to come beat the fuck out of you. Yeah, that's the reason why I have to wipe down my toilets every time I piss. Yeah, fucking piss on the toilet. Yeah, bitches. There's a sign back there that said, don't be a, don't wipe, it's Mousy Beulah says wipe yeah. the toilet seats, right? What do you have to say to someone who pisses all over the seat there and doesn't wipe You're it up? disgusting. What else? You need to go to jail, and you need to be beaten to smithereens. You need your ass beaten until you poop yourself. And you will have skin marks in your underwear 24 seconds. And what do you have to say to that person? When was the one last thing you want to say to that person? Die. Yeah, <laughs> fucking die. <laughs> Anyways, thank you for checking out this video. 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 Thank you for checking out this video. Tell your boss to fuck off. We'll see you on the next adventure. And one more thing, if you don't subscribe to my channel, you're a fucking asshole. Okay. Right. Thank you, everybody. And another thing about there, Copain is a famous bakery in New York. It's a well-known bakery, and that is where they get those delicious, nice, yeasty buns from and that are cookies. just amazing. And those amazing and they're cookies. They're pies and um, hand pies. There's like a pie there that was filled with uh, berries was their flavor of the week, they said. Mm, we didn't try that, but we yeah. tried the cookie. The cookie was amazing. The buns absolutely stood out. Um, and I think it's cool that they order the stuff from there and bring you that delicious, you know, buns, bring you that those, those delicious buns, those delicious cookies and pies and stuff and uh, right on your plate. It's so good. So I highly recommend coming out here. And they, I love how they loaded you with pickles. You didn't even have to ask for extra pickles. They just covered yeah. you with pickles. And I always ask for extra and pickles. And forgot about it, apparently. Yeah, I didn't even think about the it. The amount of pickles they yeah. had. So that's and I didn't even have to ask. That's so awesome. Like, that is an outstanding chicken restaurant, a very unique sandwich. It definitely stands out. The butte sauce, like I said, fucking amazing. I mean, not, not the butte, the bossy sauce. The bossy sauce. I got the butte. Uh, with cheese and then the bossy sauce sandwich. Stella said it should be bussin' because it's bussin'. Right, yeah. Stella? Yeah. It's bussin'. But, um, yeah, you definitely want to check that place out. What, Stella? Ah! Are you gonna shoot me, Stella? What'd I do? Okay. Did I fuck up? Okay. Alright.